Hey, welcome back everybody. You're tuning in to DraftingTutorials.com. Uh, my name is Casey Kepley, and in today's video, I'm going to be covering uh, recent input. Now, this is an option that you can use to basically just repeat uh, a task or a certain command that you were using. So you don't have to actually go back to the uh, command line here and retype the command. Uh, there's a simpler way to do that. So if you right click, you can go with recent input. Um, so just to give you an example here, I could type in area, right, to find the area of an object. And we'll go ahead and back out of that real quick. Right click. And if you go to recent input, the area command has been saved. So as you're working through your drawings and you're entering in commands, it'll keep track of it over here under a recent input and you can just go back to it, click on it, and it'll bring up the uh, command for you. So it's it's an easy way to, you know, kind of as a shortcut so you don't have to go back and forth to the command and, and retype some of the commands that you're using. Um, other than that, that's all I have for today. Uh, I'm just showing you guys some ways that you can be a little bit more efficient with uh, AutoCAD and it'll save you time in, in the long run when you're working on some of these drawings because one thing I've noticed uh, as I'm going through the drafting program is that uh, some of these projects that, that you can work on uh, they can get pretty tedious as far as time management just because you're you're finding yourself going back and doing a lot of the same things over and over and over um, so this is one way to go ahead and save you some time on that and uh, you know, other than that, that's all I have for today. Hope you guys have a good one, and um, I'll talk to you later.